Um, and that requires the bedroom key, which maybe is in the office, so... <laughs> Hey, what's happening everyone? This is Yami Mash, and welcome to another indie horror game. This one is called A Late Night Mop. I heard this game is uh, very good. It's quite short, but it's uh, a lot of fun. Uh, it was made by Lixion. Clearly the carpet needs more than a mop, it needs a hoover, so I wouldn't be mopping the carpet. Let's start and play the game. This is going to be really fun. Hey, sorry for calling you so late, but uh, would you mind going by the house and do a quick cleanup? I, uh, I made a bit of a mess a and I need up. the house cleaned as I have some guests coming over in the morning. I thought you said he has okay, gas you. coming over. <laughs> I can imagine him just letting one rip. Okay, so I'm like the uh, the, the maid, basically. Maid yummy mash here. Okay, here we go then. This is a nice home. Oh, the lights just turn on automatically via motion. Picking up my mop, guys. And there's a spill. I don't know what he did here. It looks like he urinated or something. But I think we should give this a good clean. Yeah, there we go. Wow. Uh, the uh, the demon of the house did not like me doing that. But anyway, let's continue. Oh, it's raining outside, of course. Can I go in this room? The door is blocked by something. You know, he needs to get a painter as well, a decorator or something, because this wallpaper is stained and dirty. He needs uh, he needs some professional help, even though technically I am professional help. I am the cleaner and uh, I do this for a living. Oh, pick up the trash and place it in the bin. I won't be needing my mop for this. There we go. All right, no scary thunder when I clean up there. Thank God for that. Task list, entrance, bathroom, living room, kitchen, hallway, office, master bedroom, and the master bathroom. I can do all that, that's not a problem. If I click main menu, is it just going to send me back to the... Yeah, it will send me back to the main menu, so let's not press that, obviously. Oh, uh, he's like pooped all over the floor, this is disgusting, and how did he get like paper all in the sink? What, what's he been doing in front of this mirror? Okay, this needs to go in the bin as well. I think I just stepped in poop, guys. That is quite disgusting. <laughs> oh, my God! Oh, damn you, Icy! <laughs> Icy, Tinky Winky does not belong in this home, okay? <laughs> Thank you so much for the bits, Icy. Oh, my Lord. She must have came out from the forest over there. Okay, let's clean up all this poop. There we go, this is a very clean bathroom now. My heart is racing, that made me jump. Oh, he has really made a big mess. Uh, this door is locked, requires an office key. Oh, I'm sure we'll come across that. How did he manage this? What's he been doing in here? Has he been like part, has he had like one of those house parties and his guests were just super like inconsiderate or something? Someone's like knocking on the window. Do you guys hear that? Can I like draw back these curtains and have a peek? Because I was hearing some tapping sounds coming from outside there. It's Tinky Winky. Tinky Winky's trying to get in. Okay, let's pick this up and put this in the bin over here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh man, it is a state. This is reminding me a little bit of a power wash simulator somewhat. Because, uh, well, it just is, you know, I'm cleaning up. That's basically what that game is. He's got like water bottles everywhere. At least he drinks water. Lots of spring water. That's very healthy, and I'm, I'm very proud of this guy. But uh, I'm not proud about his sanitation. That is disgusting. Ooh, a can of soda. Very nice. Okay, there are just bottles all over the place, so this is going to take me quite some time. I have noticed something. I'm putting these in the bin, but the bin is already tied. So technically, I'm just putting them down the side of this bin bag here, and it's creating more of a mess, and I'm going to have to get another bin bag and, like, tip them all in there, so... I'm not doing this very well, really. As a professional cleaner, I think this is a very um, backwards method that I'm doing, but I, I won't, I won't question uh, this person's uh, skills in the profession, even though technically I am that person. But then I'm breaking the fourth wall a little bit. All right, I think I've put all the uh, bottles in the bin there. Yep, still hearing creepy noises. Let's now uh, start mopping the floor a little bit more. This mop is not very wet, actually. I'm not leaving any, like, moisture on the floor. I'm just dry cleaning this uh, these stains. This is probably the greatest mop in existence. You don't need a mop bucket. You don't need a wet pad. You, you just, you're just going for it. Like, I know there's a pad on there, but it's clearly dry. This is a fantastic mop. Amazing. It's a magical mop. 
Oh, this one's very dirty. Oh, don't you worry, guys. Just two little pushes of my mop, and it is clean. You know what? If I was a professional cleaner IRL and I had this mop, it would be a very easy job. Oh, yeah. I would happily just do this for a living. It would be easy. There we go. Look at this. I'm already halfway through the home. This has took very little effort whatsoever. I'm hearing weird noises all around me. I like how he has three candles lit, by the way. I don't know how long he's left this home for, but those candles have not melted in the slightest. There is no wax dripping off the edges of those candles. So it's like they've just been lit, literally as I just got here like five minutes ago. And that's kind of uh, kind of worrying, because I don't think he lit those candles. Maybe it was the mop monster. <gasps> what if the demon is the mop? All right, all right, stop rushing me. Maybe it's coming from inside this little cabinet here. Let's go in here. All right, what other... Oh, my Lord. All right, is there a bin in this hallway? Because that would save me some time. No, okay. I've noticed that the office key is over there on that little uh, table there. So um, clearly it's a big deal, me going into that room. Um, I don't know what awaits me in the room, but I'm sure we'll find out soon enough. So let's continue placing all of this trash in the bin, and then um, then I'm going to mop. That's that's my strategy. I'd, I'd rather, like, not mop first, because if I was mopping in real life again, like, I wouldn't be mopping around mess on the floor, like, if I had trash all over the floor. You, you would always, you'd always clean the trash first and then mop. Because you're just going to make more of a mess. And then once you remove the trash, you know, things might drip or come come off of the uh, the products. And then you have to clean the floor a second time. And who wants to do that? Okay, I got the office key. Um, and that requires the bedroom key, which maybe is in the office. So... <coughs> oh my god! Jesus! Wow, that, that really, really made me jump. Mmm, okay. Alright, all is good. All is fine. Oh, God, I'm sorry for picking up your office key, sir. <laughs> yeah, at this point, at this point, I'd be leaving the building, you know. Okay, I, I'm not even doing my strategy anymore. I, I'm, I'm going to do it the other way around now. Yeah, I'm going to mop in them. <laughs> okay okay <laughs> we got the jump scare noises as well i like it okay this is great this is fun oh what's that on the floor there is that like a message i thought there was like a little hidden message on the floor i saw some like text anyway this is great i'm enjoying it. wait this is a trash bin this like a little laundry um laundry bin here is being used for trash <laughs> i'm the worst <laughs> I'm the worst cleaner ever. I love it. Okay, you know what? I think at this point my my character has just kind of given up and now is like, you know what? I, I'm just going to do the job as fast as humanly possible and get out of here. And I don't blame them. I don't blame them at all. You know, I would like to leave. I'm kind of scared to turn around, actually, because they did it to me last time. When I picked up the key and I turned around, he was at the door. I'm thinking this could happen a second time, which would be a little bit lazy, but I'm kind of expecting it. No, good. Okay, that, that that makes me happy. Okay, let's uh, let's leave. Hello, is he watching TV? Imagine if he was just chilling on the sofa right now with like a can of soda, just watching TV. <laughs> that'd be uh, that'd be pretty chill actually. Oh, I don't like the ambiance. <gasps> mm, I said I told you guys I didn't like the ambiance there. I just kind of like felt it was coming. You know, I just it was like a gut feeling. God, man, I don't know how I'm still like soldiering on here. Like how. Do this guy needs money. I need to pay my bills, clearly, because he is not stopping. Okay, here we go. Oh, she. She is not stopping. You know, it, it could be anyone. I, I think I just... I'm referring to he because I'm playing as the cleaner. So I see myself kind of, like, as this person right now. So that's why I'm saying that. Well, this mop works on carpets, too. Incredible. What an incredible piece of equipment. Mm-hmm. Okay, cool. That is a juicy stain. You could tell that stain was wet. It had like reflection and everything. This one's a bit more dry. So these ones are older. I can just imagine that he's actually made this mess over like a period of a week or two. And um, oh wait, there's like claw marks there. Actually, what if it's blood? What if I've been cleaning up blood this whole time? Just dried blood because it goes black. Now that would be worrying. Okay, I need to go all the way. Like, well, There must be a bin in this room. Here it is. 
I was gonna say, there's no way I needed to go all the way back down to the kitchen just to put this trash in the bin. I am a little bit paranoid about going into that room over there because there's claw marks, and claw marks is always a very bad sign that whatever that monster is, he most likely lives in that room. So yeah, and it's the bathroom, it's the master bathroom, so uh, I don't know what's going on. Maybe the shower curtain will be drawn. Most of the jump scares I've played in horror games over like you know the past decade, typically it all happens inside a bathroom or a toilet facility. So I'm not surprised that this is uh, where the finale is probably going to be. But here it goes. Okay, I still haven't cleaned the master bedroom. There's one more bottle. Okay then, uh, we need to go into the master bed uh, bathroom. Uh, this is barricaded. I can't go that way. There is no other way for me to go. So uh, prepare your pants, everyone. I'm preparing mine. Let me just... I drew up my coat a little bit. I, I'm keeping a bit more warmth in because I think all the heat's going to escape me as soon as I open this door. Oh, nice. Okay. Okay, yeah, I, I think I kind of I, I kind of expected something like this, you know, a, a lot of blood. I didn't know about the candles. I wasn't expecting the candles. Okay, so I need to clean up the blood now. Oh, this will be interesting. I wonder what's going to happen as soon as I clean it up. A pentagram. That, okay, I'm just taking a guess now, guys. I want you all to also, maybe in the comments section, put what you think is going to be underneath this blood stain, okay? Everybody, you know, I'll give it a few seconds. Write down in the comments section what you think is going to be underneath this blood stain. Okay, obviously if you've seen this game before, you know. Alright, here we go. Oh, it's taking some time. There's a lot of blood here. You know, I should probably just close the door behind me, right? Can I do that? No. Oh boy. Nothing! There was nothing under the blood stain. That is the most anticlimactic thing I've ever seen. Imagine if it was, a, like, my face. <laughs> Imagine if it was a picture of my face under the stain. How scary would that be? Uh, okay, can I open the... Oh, God, hello. Just go home. We've done our job. We can leave now. Nothing bad is going to happen. That would be the most anticlimactic ending ever, but I'm uh, I'm looking forward to seeing what's going to happen. <sighs> okay. Hello. Okay. Everything is fine. Nothing is happening. They've, they've even given me a nice green apple. How polite. It's like a bonus. It's like how companies feed their workers with food, usually pizza. I get an apple. I'm hearing noises. Alright, can we run? No. Oh boy. Yeah, the light bulb exploded. Let's just leave. <gasps> no, 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 no. No. Who? Who? No. No, 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 no. Who in their right mind would go back in there and investigate the noise after seeing a demon on three separate occasions and then saw candles with blood all over the floor and then the light bulb explodes and then you go back into the house? No, nobody would do that. That is not realistic. Let's do it. All right, what was that? <gasps> it's all good. <laughs> it's fine. I think I almost broke my chair, by the way. Is my chair okay? Yeah, it's fine. I think. Very dead. Um, it might be a little too late to be saying this, but maybe don't go into my house. I, uh, I remember I kinda summoned a demon and totally forgot about it. Anyways, I uh, hope you're good and healthy and alive. Okay, bye. All right, thank you for that. You probably should have told me that on the first phone call. Okay, what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to play through it all again, and we're going to try and get the very alive ending. So I'm going to get back to that point, and then we're not going to investigate the noise, and I'm going to try and leave, okay? So I'll see you all in a second. Hello, welcome back, everyone. Okay, we've cleaned the bathroom again, so we're just going to leave this time. We're not going to go back and check the exploding light bulb, okay? <gasps> There's a hand under the bed. Ooh, this is where the demon lives. He doesn't sleep on the bed. He sleeps under the bed. Okay, it's not really very comfortable, is it? I mean, that's definitely a lot less comfy than being on those nice clean sheets. Isn't it always nice to clean the sheets? It's just so much more comfortable. Okay, here we go. Let's not make the same mistake twice. So the demon crushes the light bulb, makes it explode, but I'm just going to leave. So, so long, sucker. I'm leaving. I don't get paid enough for this. And there we go. Easy peasy, right? That was it. Hey, thank you so much for no cleaning problem. the house. I really appreciate it. How much do I Although get? Although you did 
did break a very special and very expensive antique and left all the pieces for me to clean, so I'll be deducting that from your payment. So yeah, thanks for that. <laughs> All right, well, we got the good ending, and actually, everyone, there is a final and third ending, which I am going to do right now, and that will only take me, like, five seconds to do, because uh, the third and final ending is we go in, and we don't clean anything, and we just leave. So I'm going to do that right now, and that will be all three endings. So I'm leaving. <laughs> That was a whole different jump scare. I never expected that. That didn't happen before. But we can leave. So we haven't finished our job cleaning. We are like, screw this. There's a demon in the house. We're going home. We don't get paid enough for this. <laughs> oh my god. Thank you, Gubiticus. We're leaving. So long. Bye bye. Let's see what my boss has to say about that. Well, 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 glad to know I could count on you to get the job done. Oh, wait, you didn't. There's a demon in your house. You made me look like a fool. Thanks a lot. Oh, and also, you're fired. Oh, yeah, sorry for not telling you about summoning a demon on the first playthrough, but on the third playthrough, when I just leave and there is a demon in your house, I'm fine. Yeah, sure, I never want to go back into your house anyway. Well, well, everyone, I hope you enjoyed that game. That was a late, my, late night mop. What a fantastic game. I really enjoyed it. It was super scary. It was super quick, and it had a great purpose, and it was funny, too. It had good humor, so thanks for watching this video. I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you all again very soon. Bye-bye, everyone. Let's get, 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 let's get